pulls away to a comfortable win and it is brilliant. This is vintage Van Niekerk. Van Niekerk in lane five. Men's 400 metres. Cleanly away. South African started pretty quickly. The American, Tony Mackay, has moved up quickly inside and there you can see often goes off quickly the American. Van Niekerk now making up some ground. Majlak and Makwala started well. Borle being left a little bit out in lane eight. Also going well is Taplin in lane two. Is Van Niekerk through the first 200 metres, probably with about a two metre lead. Looks very comfortable, doesn't he? Taplin going well and two starting to come through. Makwala trying to go with Van Niekerk as well, but it might be Taplin just with a half a metre advantage. So here comes Van Niekerk, they're almost changing gear here. And Van Niekerk moving away from the rest. Van Niekerk's going to win this as a bit of a canter. Van Niekerk wins it. Cedinho finished quickly. 44-1-3. Cedinho second. This is perhaps the best clash of the year so far on the Diamond League circuit or anywhere else. Over one lap for men. So, how is this one going to unfold? Dos Santos is an interesting entrant. Fourth from right there in the uh, turquoise, just out inside Van Niekerk down the back straight. Looks like uh, Vern Norwood has gone on very conservatively third from left, otherwise nobody else showing. Three, Samu Konga has pulled up in lane three. That's a great shame. Round the crown of the bend, just beginning to show now is Van Niekerk. Dos Santos moving up inside him. Van Niekerk just easing into the lead around that bend. But look at Dos Santos there with the blonde hair and on the outside going really well is Nene. But now Van Niekerk stretches that stride out, pulls away to a comfortable win and it is brilliant. This is vintage Van Niekerk. Crosses the line there, 44.08. It's the fastest time he's produced this year. And that is Van Niekerk coming back to his very, very best. A meeting record away, Van Niekerk, 44-08. Not much in it. Verberg's gone off pretty quickly, but not a lot in it as they go into the back straight. Verberg now is making some headway. He's already up on Mashlak of the Czech Republic and the lot wide range striding. Kirani James heads towards 200 metres. He looks so comfortable, he really does. Uh, McDonnell of Jamaica going quite well on the inside. But Kirani James, such a powerhouse, just eases round from 200 to 400 metres. Absolutely superb. Borle chasing him. Verberg now has got a lot of work to do. And look at Van Nierkirk on the outside. Van Nierkirk is really pressuring. Can he beat Kirani James? This would be a big, big upset. Van Nierkirk is coming through to win. Van Nierkirk gets it. James in second place. And I think Verberg may well have got third. 43.97. And that is a new a national record for South Africa. And that's a sensational performance. He ran a perfect race. 43. Point nine six. There's many people expecting something rather special from Van Niekerk here tonight. If the gloves come off and he gives it 100%, Van Niekerk's in five, Makwala in lane six. Well, away they go. Will Van Niekerk take this out aggressively? Already, I think Makwala's taken half a meter out of him in the light blue, third to left there on your picture. Van Niekerk now getting into his running and there's an acceleration there at about 110 meters. A visible acceleration from the South African. 150 done and he's breezed past Makwala who is in fabulous form, we know that. Now this is fast from Van Niekerk through 250. He's settled here, running nice and steadily. Outside him, Norwood has been passed and he's two lanes outside Van Niekerk. Now Makwala kicks hard on the crown of the bend and Van Niekerk loses a couple of meters from the Botswana there into the straight and brilliant running two from Thebe in the orange there in lane four. Van Niekerk, has he got the legs to outlast? The man from Botswana, yes he has by a meter. Watch the clock, 43.75. And that was a special race, a real contest to the line. They had to run a long way under 44 seconds just to get in the first two there. But that, Steve, fastest time in the world this year for Van Nico. Probably just what he needed, a really good effort where he had to dig deep.
Last night, remember, it was announced too that Kirani James, a former Olympic champion, won't contest the World Championships. He's uh, suffering from illness. But Van Niekert goes in lane five. A lot of eyes on the South African. Well, will Van Niekert go out fast? He's set a personal best of 994 just a couple of weeks ago for 100. And then last Wednesday, a world lead, a world best, I should say. And some would call it a world record for 300 meters. That was a Michael uh, Johnson record. Central picture, Van Niekert there moves past a man outside him very smoothly, Michael Cherry. And Van Niekert goes through 200 meters, I would say in around high 20s. He hasn't really blasted that first 200 meters. Looks like a measured run this from Van Niekert. Going really strongly outside him is Makwala though in the light blue. Left to picture, Makwala possibly heads him into the last 100 meters as Van Niekert now begins to stride away and eats up the ground and eases away from Makwala whose stride is shortening. Great running in three from Thebe as Van Niekert there takes it. He wipes away the 21 year old meeting record of Michael Johnson and a very, very solid opener indeed from Wade Van Niekerk. If I tell you, 43.62 is a time beaten by only four other men in history. Johnson, Butch Reynolds, Jeremy Warner and Quincy Watts, all men of uh, a previous era. Then you'll uh, understand just how well this man is operating. Beautiful run from him. More to come, surely.